All righty, folks. Hello and welcome to Daytona International Speedway, the road course. My name is John Theodore, streaming live at twitch.tv slash John underscore underscore Theodore, recorded version of this broadcast at youtube.com slash John Theodore. Thank you very much for tuning in. Going to be in the number 27, Corey Bush for Congress Chevrolet Camaro ZL1. Getting grid up here. We got Mike Seal in the uh, spotter stand. Mike, go ahead and say hello to the people. Mike? We lost Mike! Oh no! If you're not on the grid, please get on the grid now. Anyway, Mike's going to be uh, coaching me along here and uh, helping me out, so you'll see him pop up on the uh, team channel. Um, Sorry about that, I read. One thing I want to point out before a race is I want to I want to call attention to the shirt yeah, that I'm wearing. This is a <laughs> shirt that I got at the exhibit for the uh, yeah, the, the art exhibit um, for uh, commemorating Mike Brown. It's a five year anniversary of uh, when we tragically lost Mike Brown uh, to a police shooting, which is um, you know it really that was an event that that changed things uh, here in St. Louis. So, uh, you know, just take a moment to um, remember him. And I also want to encourage anyone who hasn't seen it to uh, watch the movie Stranger Fruit. Um, and, uh, you know, it's a very good documentary that, um, you know, really focuses on uh, the, the, the story of both Mike Brown and, um, and his family. So, uh, appreciate you guys. Thank you all for tuning in. And, uh, we're going to get ready to go green here. Mike, do you have a copy, man? There we go. All right. That was a messy start. Our right side by half. Clear. Stay low. Stay low. Clear all around. Our right side. He's pulling you clear. He's going to blow an engine before this thing's over. Okay. Yeah, we just want to get in space and log laps. We don't want to be around all this stuff. Got our former teammate right behind us there. Jack Racing Live, how you doing? Oh yeah, the 53's hurt on the uh, straights. There we go, nice straight entry off. Exit. <laughs> it's all about those entries off. Oh, 
Clear back by one. Ten four. Those two guys behind me are real fast. I might just let them. I'm gonna let this guy go right now. I'm gonna let this guy go too. He was the. 17 was the fastest guy in practice. I don't want any part of him. I'm just letting these guys by who, you know, were in practice lapping two seconds, three seconds a lap quicker than me. Follow them and see if we can learn something. Has a bit better through there. Yep. Yeah, it's definitely going to help if I can keep the toe of these guys on these long straights. Big A on the block, what is happening, my man? Very nice, you there? Yeah, that felt good. I actually gained on Ryan Hill, which is miraculous. Didn't hit the apex that time. Right. Nice save, Ryan. I don't know what the road is at. Nine hundred horsepower for the win, right, Birdman Demi? I have so many horsepowers tonight. Feels good. Yeah, 10 4. I'm kind of regretting letting Ryan by now. Too hard into that corner. It killed my exit. Yeah, 
that one too. That that turn more than any. Fell in too slow. I felt like I was too fast into that one too. No, you were way too fast. Yeah. Yeah, both I both of those last two corners. Sloppy lap. Uh, I one turn you have to hit more than any other. Look out for your second easy. Oh, we're gonna build some X's tonight. <laughs> Big A on the block, four months. Thank you, man, with the Twitch Prime sub. Appreciate that. Let's get some sub hype in the chat. Make sure you get slowed down. Yeah, just. Gotta hit those breaking points. I gotta use my breaking points, not theirs. Yep, and uh, a little bit later cut so you come out straighter. Mm hmm. No pressure from behind. 10 4. Yeah, this lap's going a lot better than the previous one did. Uh, already got one disconnect. Might have actually been too slow into that corner. And maybe a little bit too flat on the entry, too. I could swing that out a little bit wider. Yeah, I'd, I'd do so. I think coming in tight is good, but then, like, right at the end, swing it out a little bit to get the good arc through the corner and apex it properly. Oil. Tag the third curb more? Okay. This is where we're going to eat up the 53. That engine damage is really hurting them right now. There we go. That looks nice. Felt better, yeah. was almost bad. Well, 
Alright, let's get slowed down for this and give me a good late cut. Okay. A little bit later than that. Then we'll show her. Ooh. Gather it up. Gather it up. No Got it. From behind. Alright. Now that you got that out of your system, let's uh, get the shipping. And I'd say the next eight cars are vulnerable if you lay down, you know, get some good consistent laps in the low. Low 45s. 10-4. Cheers, mate. Ah, Thunderfoot. Dude, it looked like you were going to give it to me, then you stopped in the breaking zone. I wasn't going to give anything. It's breaking for the corner. Ah, that felt better right there. Look better. Ten four Birdman Demi, I'll try that. Hit the curbs a little bit straighter. Ah, too late there. I'm kidding. Oh, that car. Oh no, Kalen's bitten. Did Kalen get killed? No, yeah, that was fine. Interesting. I wonder if he's calculated something with tire fall off that just doing half fuel runs is better than full. That'd have to be some mighty dramatic fall off. Yeah, it would. It's about three seconds a lap, but, or not three seconds a lap, but like, well, yeah, I mean, Right now, my tires are probably three to five seconds a lap slower than they were at the start of this run. came up with a good analogy recently for what it feels like to hit a corner right, Mike. Let me know if you agree with this. Feels like flying through a tube that is just larger than your body without ever touching the sides. Yeah, 
And yeah, once you do it, you just want to do that every single time again. You're like, oh man, I want to feel that again. <laughs> oh wow, hello. Just gained a ton of time with that exit right there. <laughs> Spitz, I do remember that. That was awesome, man. That was I'm, good. There are any spots you're having trouble, like getting the power down, short shifting, uh, usually isn't that option. 10 4 on that, yeah. Good call. Pitboard says seven laps of fuel left right now. That was a nice lap time. Some people are pitting really early. I don't know about that. You know, the guy was pit in and pit out in about 50 seconds. Yeah, I mean, we'd probably want to pit stop every 30 minutes, I would think, would be about right. Got to remember that it's a timed race, not a lapse race. I'll try that Birdman Demi. Trying to work on improving one little thing at a time. That was a much better turn one. Do the different color socks help? Visually, they help the uh, stream. Gather it up, gather it up, get the power down, get the power down. Psychologically, they, uh, they make the game more fun. Yeah, that was a lock up on entry there. That was playing. Got no pressure from behind, so you can take the you want to get in there. 10-4. Alright, hour 37 left right now.
says we've got five laps of fuel. We'll pit at the... Th yeah, I, th I think that rolling this every 30 minutes, three stops. Uh, these cars are uh, have a special transmission that doesn't require the clutch to shift. The Jericho transmission. It was definitely better than last lap through there, that's for darn sure. I just had a weird bug. Oh yeah? Giant rainbow here. Oh that's interesting. I mean, it, it wasn't like a proper rainbow, but it was this big, arcing, multicolored object going on top of the sky. Not a good run on you. Was it, uh, like, lens flare gone bad or something? Well, I got... Yeah, I think so. Got a better car than I need to go around me. Hey. Matter, I need to leave and go find a pot of gold. Go find that gold, Mike. One off the track on the right side, it shouldn't be an issue for you. Yeah, he's already back on. Ah, oh, that's smart. That cost him a bunch. He was running sixth. Ouch. Just got turn one and gain like 30 seconds. Yeah, that'll do it. Just go straight through there to, instead of taking it. Thank you, sir. No problem. Nice looking ride. I just messed that up. Forgot that I don't break for that corner. Only cost me a, a little bit of time, though. Ooh. All right, one more lap and then we'll pit. Actually, let me check. I think we might actually want to pit now. All right, 
just be careful on entry. Uh, this is not a uh, plate set up heat profile, so the tires may act a little different. 10 4. Yeah, I definitely want to pit now. I don't want to. 27 pitting. Pit now rather than deal with uh, having to give up the spot to Mike here. Too, uh, Start looking for your sign. A little bit too hesitant coming in there, but better that than Five, get caught speeding. Four, three, two, one. Are you sure? Stop I thought side. I only went into one other than mine. I turned in, but. I was never in anybody else's pit stall except for one. On exit, you drove through seven coming out. Uh, ten four. I didn't even think about exit. My bad. Car Would not be some emerging issues. So there is someone in the dirt on the left side. You can turn around. And four. Who's that going? Wouldn't be surprised if that uh, pit road mm -hmm. exit caught someone out at some point during the race. Is anyone watching the broadcast? How did this thing look on the uh, TV broadcast? I bet these cars look awesome going around here. With yeah, the uh, sun setting and darkness setting in. They left. Got it gathered. Pass them left. All right side. Clear. Yeah, he stayed out on those tires one lap too long, I think. That felt a little bit better. All right, Mike, tires. I'm just gonna read you the center per wear percentages. Right front, 91. Right rear, 91. Left front, 86. Right, left rear, 91. Thank you. 10-4, I'll keep an eye out for uh, why that left front's wearing. 10-4. Got one off track on the right side. He's staying right there. Thanks, Evan. One entering the track in front of you. 
Uh, this is the guy that we're racing with. That undercut put us right on his bumper. Start diving low on your right side. Clear. Sorry. Sorry, right, hold half the small. You're fine. Thanks for that call there. I saw him coming in, but uh, that was a good call. It was an aggressive move. Yeah, and he apologized for it, so I don't think he necessarily meant to send it at that point, but pretty sure he's one of those guys that's a good bit faster than me just on raw pace right now, so I'm not going to push the issue with him too much. The way we'll beat him is if he uh, puts it off a couple times and we get a chunk of time that way. Or if we get the pit strategy better than he does. That felt good right there. Now you gained a chunk of time on those two. Yeah, it was just a good smooth entry into one. Kind of gave it up in uh, four over there a little bit. I was a little bit too hot in. I think I can mount on a bit much. Yep. Uh, left front was worn the most, Birdman Demi, not the left rear. The left rear was the same as the right front and the right rear. Everything was 91, except the left front was at 86. Thank you. Yeah, no worries. I might have reported them in a confusing manner. There we go. That was better than last lap. Yeah, it was. That was worst, but I salvaged the clock there. <laughs> yeah, I just got to back up that and come through a little bit more. Mm-hmm. There we go, that's a good exit out of the bus stop there. Daniel, just take it going into the horseshoe. Kalen must have hurt the car somehow. He's almost lapped down or he's lapped down to me. 
My right side, clear. Turns like that will wear the left front. Thanks. Hit the apex is a little more all right, yeah. I think I just need to back up my entries a little bit so that I can get my uh, apex is more accurate. See if we can get some more time in on Austin up there. That's basically who we're racing with all race long. That's kind of our race long battle is at the 53. And the only reason he, we're really keeping up with him is because he's hurting so bad on the straights. If we connect our corners together, we'll run him down no problem. Too flat. Yeah, this is the race, Spitz. But it is kind of like practicing and using the race for practice. We're learning and getting better. You, you got to really back that turn up. 10-4. Yeah, I've been breaking... I've been using that access, like that access road inlet there as the, my braking point. I think I need to brake before that rather than in the middle of it. And then back it up a ton and uh, move it forward once you start hitting that turn a few times in a row. Okay. Uh, two hour race, Nathan. We've got a uh, hour 18 left. If you lose a half second on entry here, bag it up. Better. Still a couple more times and we can look at uh, pushing more Zeshi. Ten four.
Oof. Almost lost it there. Had to get out of it. That kind of killed my whole uh, straightaway here. So the 53 is seven seconds in front of us right now. I should maybe short sift that actually, so I can get the power down better. I was just about to say the same thing. That was a much better bus stop, though. Guy in front of me is getting squirrely. Apex that too early. That was smart again. He had made his way back up to 12th after his previous one. Tough night for him. some time to Austin that lap. Tyler Lugo victory has manually disconnected. Thank you. Let's see if we can use this guy to draft a little bit here. Oh, that's Kalen. Thanks, man. I was actually going to follow you. No, you're way faster. Yeah, his car's really banged up. Probably faster on the straights, but he's likely quicker than me through the road course in general.
you for letting off again. That felt a little bit better through the bus stop. Alright, we're eight seconds behind the 53 now. Get it back on track, no pressure. Okay. Just completely missed my breaking point there. Someone said oof. That can't be good for somebody. Hey, Tyler. I didn't even uh, see what you said, man. I'm sorry that you didn't have a good run, though. Gasso, how's it going? Welcome. But yeah, Tyler, I hope you come back uh, next week in the... Some issues here. 10-4. This corner right here, exiting, it was the one that I spun on the most in uh, practice. Doing good, man. Just uh, enjoying uh, driving these cars on road courses, which I really, really have fun with. Okay, the short shift there uh, seemed to be about a push, but it was definitely more stable. Maybe a little bit better overall. I forgot to do it the lap before, so that was my first lap trying it. Thing that makes it more consistent is how we can be faster overall. Yeah, 10-4. I just need to remember, I need to get it into my rhythm, and then it'll be even quicker. Oh man, Samar just lost it again. Oh goodness, we got a sub. Cell 55. Five. I'll get you on the front straight. 13 months. That's awesome, man. Thank you for that. Welcome.
You do know this track, my man. How you doing? Um, instead of a uh, tire track, I'd uh, ended in a puff of smoke. I'm not sure what happened there. Uh, my auto was off the track. He's in a, he was in 11th, and now he's the next car in front of me. All right, let's see. Still got five minutes before we want to pit. Yeah, I had a slow down right there. We got about four more laps in the tank. Okay. I'm pitting this spot there. All right. Next one, yeah, the 24 hours of Daytona next year is going to be fun. I am going to try to run Pete, Petit Le Mans with you guys, uh, or with you though. That'll be fun. We'll see if we can make that work with the schedule. I think we can. I'm also thinking about doing the uh, Bathurst 1000. Just a matter of if I can fit it in. I'm really trying to focus on dedicating proper practice time to the leagues. Especially that mixed class oval league now that I'm leading the points. Mike and I are going to go win a championship in that one. <laughs> right Mike? <laughs> I want the trophy. All right, my auto's pitting. Uh, you're on new cars. I'd say a uh, 30 minute pit window is open. Yeah, can you see uh, how much time's left on the clock right now? One hour, three minutes, 20 seconds. Okay, yeah. I want to try to pit with like at least 101 to go. Yeah, yeah I'd say next time by enough this time. Call the right back, please. Ten four. Left side, sorry. Someone kind of caught me out, so I was looking at time. Ah, <sighs> all right. We have fresh tires behind. Yeah, ten four. Yeah, I see that. Eyes coming right side. He's there. On your door right side. Pulling the whole width. I'm gonna just gonna let him in front so that I can draft him here. Okay. I have some damage, yeah. Uh, Okay, you got me, David. I'm on the left side. Gonna have one entering on the left side. Yeah, 10 4. I'm gonna slide him behind him. Or never mind. Left side. Here. Oh no. Lock it down. Straighten it out. Pull back on tracks. No worries. No cars coming. Okay, good. 
Good, good, good. Alright, let's go, let's go, let's go. Hit this time. Yeah, 10-4. Those tires are gonna be a little warm. Yeah, that was weird. Cost us a ton of time, unfortunately. Try to be a little more aggressive on the pit entry, but not too much. Okay. I'm gonna bump up the uh, brake bias. Pitting. 27 pitting. Drivers, that's the halfway point. One hour to go. 22 coming in. 5, 4, 3, Don't worry about two, me, leaders. I'm not going to try and pass. Stop on the side. Alright, get the brake bias back where I had it. Sip of water. First Nine gear. Alright, should be no worries merging back on the track. Yeah, that was a scheduled scop, Spitz. We got one more scheduled stop for the race. Yeah, and this is a fixed setup event as well. Podium uh, Esports provides the setup. Got an hour left. Let's see if we can run that 53 back down. We are 14th right now, Mike. I'll do that. Yeah, I think we picked up another spot somewhere, either from a penalty or someone going off again.
Oh, really? Tires. I know, it's so hard to go back. Oh, yeah, Could you not challenge me for it? Pull up my left hand, I'm gonna jump now. Calm down, calm down, slow it up. We might get the 53 here. Of course, he's going to come out with fresher tires, but... Yeah, I think he's just been running it dry. It's a slightly non-optimal strategy. So we didn't catch up to him completely but that got us back all the time that we lost with the uh, spin He will have fresher tires at the end, but there's a good chance that we undercut him on our next pit stop if we can stay within range. And then he'll be running us down rather than the other way around. Pitting. Or if we clean up our lap times, we could just pass him naturally on the track. Thanks, Bobby. We got it, man. You still run off? No pressure. Too hard. Even, uh, without yeah, 10-4. If I just run clean, I'll get him. He's got that damage. We've got that in our pocket. So if we run clean, we will uh, get him.
That's some art again. Poor guy, man. So yeah, we're green through the infield there, and we lost time to uh, the 53. But when we get to the fast part of the track, we gain it all back. Leader's seven seconds back of us now. That isn't too bad, actually, given what my abilities are on road course to stay on the lead lap for the first half, three quarters of the race. Are you kidding me? Not a good way to reach. Don't, don't sit there crawling across the track. Oh, they're showing us the black flag. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, I clipped the uh, second part of the bus stop there. So I have to slow down and give up the time drain. 10 4, 10 4. Lesson learned. Just went in there a little bit too hot. That felt better. Too hot getting in there that time. Nice to remember the back step, uh, Thanks, you didn't have to do that. Thirty-nine must have damage too. Couple times I've had trouble it's finding the gate. Hit, so that's why I let you buy that. Yeah, I got you. I figured as much, but still, thanks. Ah, uh, he's on really old tires. That's what's going on. I don't know if this is going to work out for him. I think he's going to have to pit once more, maybe. I don't think so, but it looks like he's trying to do it. I don't know if he's saving some fuel or something. Or if he's just tried to switch up strategies to compensate for those couple of uh, off tracks that he had.
I think you can only run about 38 minutes before you're out of gas. That's what I was... I, yeah, I was looking at not even that. I was looking at maybe like 35 was probably 35 minutes was probably the longest that I could stretch it. So he, if he's able to run longer than that, he must really be. Maybe he's not using first gear anywhere around and giving up a little time like that, but he's able to stretch the fuel or something. That one off track on the right side. I see it. Run line. Taking on the left side. Clear. <sighs> Good job saving her there, Nino. Oh, thank you. One off track on the left side. He's merging back on. Be an issue. 39 again. Better than his other off tracks that he's had. Shouldn't put up too much of a fight. So 42 minutes right now. Yeah, I still don't, I mean, maybe if he gets it to 40, he might be in range where he could make it on one more stop. But if we pass him, it's not gonna matter. I'm pinning this guy, John. Yeah, there's no way you're making 41 minutes. I don't think so, yeah. Got the leaders coming up behind you? Yeah, 10 4. I don't want to interfere with that battle. I'll give it to them on the back straight if they're not already taking it before then. Ten four. Missed a shift, but that worked out. That was where I wanted to let him by. Yeah, it's a fuel mode. It was just, yeah, a, yeah it wasn't as clean as I wanted to do. Okay, we got 10 minutes before our final pit. Thanks, Bobby. 
You got it. All right, I'll check. All right, you gathered it up. Yeah. I'm not gonna try to pass him. Looked like he did about the same thing that I did over there uh, when I was on old tires, just trying to get inside of someone and gave it a little too much wheel and gas at the same time. But he saved it better. Uh, on your left. Uh, track on your left. Hold your line. Clear and clear. Yeah, Keith just got his new tires. Nope. Dang it. Yeah, thanks, Jeremy. Yeah. Well held. It's just cost and time, though. My goodness. You know, it's two turns in a row that he just, it was like he forgot to break. Yeah. Yeah, everyone being on different tire strategies is really making things interesting. Well, all you do is make it more. I won't back it on it. Make it Six minutes till our final stop. You'll get me into the water. <sighs> Austin's legged it out to a 12 second lead with my mistakes. Just when I said something nice about him. Sorry about the spin scare, I was too busy, worried about you guys, I missed my mark. So at the end of the day, he made an even worse mistake in his blue flag moment than I did.
Need to hit those apexes better. Aaron, go ahead and take it high here. I'd rather give it to him on that straightaway than this one. <laughs> yeah. Uh, we'll pit next lap. Psycho Boy with the sub. Thank you very much, Thank my man. Thank you. Let's get some sub hype yeah. in chat, guys. Thank you, Psycho Boy. Really appreciate that. 18 months in a row. That's fantastic. I'm losing 32 minutes, 10 seconds left. Yeah, 10-4. We're coming in uh, this time for our final stop of the race. Did not take him very long to run me down after he pitted. <laughs> Thank you, for your sign. Five, four, three, two, one. Stop on the sign. All right. Good news there. You break a little earlier than I thought. <laughs> All right. Clean final stint to the end here. Tires that time, 93, 93, 93. That's right front, right rear, left rear. Left front was an 85. So we were kinder to everything else versus the first run, except for the left front, we were worse. 
thing for. Try to run down the 39 and uh, outdrive the uh, 53 as well. Thank you. Whew. That was close. All right, 53's in the pit now. That's what, two laps that uh, we got on him with the freshies? And he just exited. It wasn't enough to uh, get him. That wasn't a particularly good uh, first lap on the freshies right there that I just had. So that's not, it's understandable. Yeah, if he makes a mistake, then we'll get him. If he doesn't, it's going to be tough. Some smoke up ahead. Yeah, I got a car off track, you toad. Okay. That's too bad. Another puff of smoke there. Yep. Daniel Jackson, that's too bad for him. Left runs used through all those right handers through the infield as well though. And I've been every time I miss my breaking points on those, it's probably working the left front. Oh boy. Uh, yeah, I didn't intend to follow him there. That was weird. Yeah, that was sweet. Back in the groove. Yep, 
Gotta hit my breaking points, not his. Previous lap was a 144.7. That ain't bad for my uh, race pace. Oh, it's not great, but it's not bad. This one's bad because of turn one. That was a pretty clean infield section there. Right there might be where I'm using my left front so much. Tata Kilo, how's it going? Welcome. see that well this will be interesting because he's gonna have fresher tires but we will be in front of him when he comes out I think he was about 26 seconds ahead of us when he went in you said it was about 50 seconds on pit road track
How much time we got left in the race? 18 minutes, 15 seconds. Okay. It's going to be tough to hold the 39 off. He's only six seconds back. I'll try. Helps that there are two cars between us. Eighteen minutes even left. Yep, stay smooth, hit the marks. Do our best. Gotta stop mission shifts. Oh no, Nino! Aaron, go past. All right, 14.25 left now.
car on the right side. So there, clear. Looking ladies there. Still there on your right side. Still there. Has a nice pass. Here. Nice pass, thirty nine. Got a blue flag now. 45's closing in on us. Take it high, Mike. All right, if we can, we'll just draft off this guy for the rest of the race. Kalen's on my bumper again. May have to let him go. Power on the right side. Clear. Ten minutes. Ten minutes left. Ten, ten minutes four. Drivers. Ten minutes remaining. Hang on to it. Hang on to it. Got it. Nathan says uh, Graham just dumped Kerwin in the last corner to win top split NIS. Apparently they're teammates. I wasn't very neighborly though. Nah. Well, we know Graham Boland would wreck his grandmother win a race just like uh, Ryan Newman.
Yeah, we shouldn't have to deal with any more traffic the rest of the race, I don't think. Um, yeah, it doesn't look that way. Except for this guy right here. Go inside, John. Thank you. Uh, on your left side, clear. Thanks, Michael. Oh, it's a handful. Showing 745 left now. Settle in and just finish this thing out. Nice and smooth. Five minutes to go. Take about two more hard ones. Might be a bit more than that, because remember when the clock runs out, that's one to go for the leader. I hope we've calculated this uh, right on fuel. I've got four laps left. That should be funny. Ten four. Mm -hmm. 
Won't have but a thimble full left at the end of this thing. Cleaned up some things this lap versus the last lap. This should be two to go this time by, I think. Next time by should be the white flag. The car guy, what's going on? David, let me know when you take the white laps left. I think it might be this time by. Let's check it Awesome. That was what we needed to hear, because if we had to go one more lap, we'd be in trouble. We can make one more. Not according to the pit board. It, well, it'd be real tight. I'd probably run out coming to the line. Yeah, you wouldn't get a cool down lap in. But... I'm showing one and a half gallons left right now. Or one and a half laps left. That's what I'm saying. Like, it's good that this is the. If this wasn't the white flag lap, we'd be in trouble. That's a very good question that uh, I will worry about after we cross the line. <laughs> Did uh, the 53 and the 39 to get together or something? No? Go in, man. Fans that race all the way. Yeah, good race. At least we didn't take each other out with the mistakes we were making early on. Yeah, I can say. Maybe someone wasn't uh, quite as exact with their fuel science or something. 
Yeah, I'm not sure. Let's uh, keep the chat down until everyone finishes. Thank you. If you'd have told me that I could uh, hang up 12th place at the end of this thing, I would have taken that. I don't know. Go ahead and take it at the line. Yep. Uh, yeah, the O2 is in 13th. P12. Thanks, Jeremy. Yeah, thanks, guys. That was fun. That was a workout. I mean, good dive. Yeah, man, thanks for uh, spotting. Had a little bit more work than you expected to, eh? <laughs> yeah, yeah, for sure. I, uh, I'm out and going to pee. All right, take care. Yeah, this is a, this is a fun one to race in for sure. Um, All right, good race, so... guys. Appreciate uh, y'all being out here tonight. I need the top three, David, Garrett, and Aaron, to uh, Discord for your Victory Lane interviews. Also, a special shout out to uh, Walsh Fox there we go. Hill. Uh, for the hard charger rewards, that was awesome to watch you guys come up through the field. Uh, just a reminder that we do pay out the top five. Payouts will be made uh, at the end of the month, so per monthly payouts for the top five. Appreciate y'all running. If you have any questions, get with yeah, me I don't on know. Discord or anywhere you want. And uh, Who... we'll see you in two weeks. Was it the O2? Is that... I get driver of the day, right? That's negative. You get 50% off hot dog at the stand. Yes! Thanks, Seth. That was fun. I'll take P24 to Seth. I'll take that. Thanks, Tyler. Yeah, I hear you, man. Hey, Mama. It went, also, there it went well. Uh, be, P12. Uh, and put on Discord in the penalty box uh, by tomorrow night. That was crazy. So, yeah, it must have been, this is Alan in the O2. Let's see what happens to him here. Oh, no. He loses it in the bus stop. So that was how he got, we got 12th. Loses it coming out of the bus stop and stuffs it in the fence. No, he didn't wreck me. I was trying to figure out um, how I ended up 12th, and that was it. Yeah, I felt bad for you, Kalen. Do you want me to take a look at uh, what happened to you real quick? Because I know that you, you're you a ton faster than me. Um... Oh, wow. Yeah, that I don't think that's anything deliberate on his part, but definitely a misjudgment. That sucks. <sighs> wow. Yeah. That's rough. And that, so that's what messed up your race, because, yeah, you were running top 10 and you ended up finishing uh, 17th. All right, let's, uh, uh, the other thing I want to go back is I want to go back and look at um, lap one, because that start was crazy. Watch it from uh, TV3 here. 
all those cars going down into turn one. 33 was sideways across the track. Everyone scrambled. Absolutely nuts. Tyler, lap one from your view. All right. What number are you? There you are. Let's watch this start from your view. Yeah, because I had a pretty crazy view of it, too. Guys are all squirrely. Yeah, that 33 getting turned was right in front of me. You did a good job getting mowed up there. Nicely done. Oh, that was the uh, server just ended there. That was good, man. You did a good job on lap one there. I just want to show again what I was seeing lap one here. Cause they were all playing bumper tag. 53 got into Kalen right on the start and then the 33 just gets booted by the 051 and the 53 gets more damage from that. Oh yeah, he did spin his tires. That stacked everyone up. Either spun his tires or, yeah, something. He just, I I don't think he spun his tires. I think he might have missed a shift. But he really just did not get going. Let's see. I want to get one in the... Uh, Right there. That looks pretty good. Ah. <sighs> You should keep running it. I mean, I'm I'm not running these things thinking I'm going to have a chance at winning them. I'm running them trying to get better at my road racing. Um, but yeah, you should definitely come run, try to run the uh, mixed class oval series with us next week. Me too, Mama. I like it. I like that. I like that I'm running it for a little bit here. I need to get it uh, the podium contingencies on it though. <clears throat> you know, just uh whole thing is trying to get better. That's a that's a pretty good start to the season for me to be honest. There are some really good drivers in there. Um big congrats to uh David Krikorian. Probably pronouncing that wrong on the uh, win. Well done. Led 28 laps. Garrett Maines led 30. Aaron Smith led 6. And Michael Pullet Classic led uh, 4. Um, that looks like all the lap leaders. 28 car field. Uh, honestly, for trying something new, that's pretty good. Hope to see more cars come out as the season um, progresses. But uh, yeah, let me see if we can... I can't see what people's I ratings are, but I think I did pretty well given, you know what, that road racing is not my strength and trying to learn 12th place feels like a really good start to the season for me. So um, thank you guys very much for watching. Really appreciate y'all if you like this video. Um, oh, one more thing. I, did, I just want to say, I said it at the beginning, I want to say it at the end, um, that the shirt that I'm wearing is um, commemorating, or it, it is, uh, this this weekend's the fifth year anniversary of when we uh, lost 
Mike Brown. So um, I was over. The, they've got an exhibit set up. They had an exhibit set up over the weekend. They had some other events. I wasn't able to make it to everything that I wanted to, but I did go over and see the exhibit. It was very moving. Um, so that I got this T-shirt there, and I got a new uh, wristband for that um, that I will be wearing. Uh, I encourage everyone uh, to go see to watch Stranger Fruit. Uh, you can get it on Amazon Prime. I don't know if it's available for, I don't think it's available for free on any of the streaming services that I know of, but you can either rent or purchase it on um, Amazon Prime. That's how I've got it. So I would encourage everyone to check that out. Um, and uh, yeah, it's just, you know, uh, the, the whole deal with Mike Brown was um was a tragic loss but it's something where you know for, for a lot of us in St. Louis it it in the time that's passed since that um has been about learning and from that and and healing and coming together uh in a lot of ways as a city and as a community so um you know for those of us who are part of that movement he's never far from our thoughts so um thank you guys for watching and uh have a good one peace out